this is all the stuff I've got for university love that for me wow there is some washing there so please excuse that but wow I really need to sort all this out wish me luck and welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm bringing you a uni haul part two my next video was going to be the six home experience video but i'm just still like prepping and planning that because i want to make sure that it's an honest and real video and i want to like make sure i give you my best tips and things to survive six months it's going to be like a six form survival guide pretty much because um I have no idea how I survived six months that long, so I'm just going to give you my best tips, I guess, in the next video. Um, so yeah, I'm still planning that one, but I thought that I would do the second half of my uni haul, um, since, yeah, I'm going to uni in, like, not long at all now. I go on the 20th of September, and it's currently the 25th, 26th, so it's Bank Holiday Monday. I hope you all had a wonderful Bank Holiday Monday. I might be uploading this tonight, I might be uploading it tomorrow, depending on how long it takes to upload, because the last one took about three hours. So yeah, it just depends. But that was a super long video, so yeah, hopefully this one won't take as long. But anyway, let's just get into it. Also, um, I have still got bits to get, like plates and like, I don't know, like washing up stuff and things like that, just like little bits that I won't include in this video, just because like if I did a third haul, it would mainly just be like, detergent wipes and towels and just like all boring stuff that like is not necessarily interesting or cute in the slightest so yeah I just thought I'd do like I'll like include a list of what I've still got to get at the end of the video because I've got a list on my phone so I'll include a list at the end of what I still need to get and then if you um need to get anything then obviously you can add to that list anyway let's get on with it because my bash tree is also flashing at me so first up i obviously got pillow cases in my last video but i didn't get actual pillows so i got these feels like down pillows they match my duvet they are so super soft and comfortable i absolutely love these and these were 12 pounds each but for good quality pillows i don't think that's too bad and they're really soft and really squidgy and the woman in the shop advised us to get these so i really like these Anyway, next up, I got this throw, and this wasn't the throw that I was on about in my last video. Um, this is just a different one that I got from Asda. Asda have some great bits in, so it's just basically a plain pink with like um, geometric um, detail, gold detailing on it. And I think this was about like five or six pounds. It wasn't. Too, it was like too, not too expensive at all. So I got this, and I really, really love this. I think this is going to be for when my friends stop over, because obviously I'm bringing an airbag and sleeping bag with me. But like, say if it's like in the summer and it's really warm and you don't need a sleeping bag, but you just need like a little blanket. So I think that's quite handy. So I'm going to show you another blanket I got for my actual bed in a second. And then I got something really boring. So I got this thing that I was on about in my last, last video. So it's like one of them um, soap scraper things. Um, and it's got these refillable like um, sponges on them. So you like fill this bit up with washing up liquid. And these are amazing. I use these all the time at home to wash the pots rather than having a normal sponge. Because you can just get in everything and like you press these down. Oh, I'm a bit out of it. There we go. I'm back. Um, yeah, you just press these down and then um, the washing up liquid comes out and it's so much easier so i love these and i would highly recommend them if you are going to uni next up i got these which i don't know if you remember my plates in the last video as in my smaller plates i've still got to get the big ones as i said um so these are little like um i'm not gonna get them out because they're like wrapped up with sellotape and everything but the they're like tea and sugar holders so they're blue and white and like got gold specks on them and they were four pounds each i got two of them because i don't like coffee so i can have one for tea and one for sugar so yeah i absolutely love them and they were discounted from nine pounds so got myself a bargain there and these most of my stuff is all from the outlet where i work so um i absolutely love that because i get all my discount and it's just absolutely amazing as well as obviously that like b&m and ikea which you know are my favorite shops at the minute <laughs> then to go with my um bedding that i got in the last video i got two fitted sheets which are both pink of course why ever not and um, these are from um dunelm i went on a massive dunelm trip thinking i was gonna get loads but i didn't and um i got these and then a pillow that i'll show you in a second but these are 28 centimeter depth they had different depths and i was like i'm not sure what depth my bed is so i'm just gonna go with this one and um, but anyway they're soft touch fitted sheets and the machine washable because obviously i want to be able to wash one and have one on my bed at the same time so these are great for that and yeah i absolutely love this pink color and everyone in uni halls who's been for like their first year says that you need two bed sheets so i got two so love these and then 
also what I got from Dunelm was this massive fluffy teddy like this teddy bear cushion and I absolutely love it it was £10 I believe which is quite expensive for a cushion but it's a big cushion and it's really fluffy I'm not going to have it on my bed I'm going to have it on my um like seat you know like the office chair that you get so I'm going to have it on there and it'll be nice and fluffy when I'm doing my work or say if my friends stop over and they need another cushion and they can always use this one so it's quite handy and I absolutely love it it's so nice and soft and I'm so excited to use it then next up I got this brush. I actually got this for when I went on holiday but I ended up using it on holiday uh, mainly because we packed it and we like had two different rooms so um, yeah it's just a watermelon brush. Nothing too exciting but um, yeah I just love it and it's going to be distinguishable at uni because obviously everyone might have like standard brushes but I thought I'd get this one because I think it's nice and aesthetically pleasing and yeah and I love it. <laughs> And then on the topic of hair as well, I've got this hair dryer. We already had this at home. It's a Silvercrest Iconic hair dryer. Um, and it has one of them detachable like things on as well. I don't know where this is from. Probably like Superdrug or Amazon or something. But we already had this at home because they might already the ones about to give out. So my mum said you can take this and then she'll have the other one. Yeah, it looks really good. So um, I'm excited to use that. And obviously I'm going to be taking my straighteners, my curlers and things like that. So, And also they have some really good straighteners and curlers for like seven or eight pounds in Primark. If you'd want to take like another pair of straighteners and you want to leave your other pair at home, they have some for like six or seven pounds and they're, they're so good. We bought the curlers when we went to go and see Ed Sheeran because we didn't bring any like hot curling tongs or anything. And then, oh my gosh, they're just amazing. So I would recommend that. Um, and then I got... These are the um, glasses I was talking about in my last video that I got from Matalan. Thought I'd show you them in this video. So it says, he sees you when you're drinking for around Christmas time. Because obviously I'm going in September and it'll soon be Christmas by the time I go. But these were reduced to £2 each because I got them in like the January, February sales. And I absolutely love them so much. And I think they'll be so good for pre-drinks in Christmas time. And I just love them so much. And I'm going to try and not use them before Christmas. But knowing me, because I'm in a proper Christmas mood, I'm going to be using these. Because <laughs> I absolutely love them. Next up, I got this for my um, cooking. That's if I'm ever going to cook, which I hopefully am. Because obviously, I don't want to be getting takeaways all the time. Anyway, I got these five clip and lock food container things. So you get five different sizes. I don't know if you can see on the back there. So you get like a large one and then it keeps getting smaller, obviously. These were from Home Bargains. I think they're like two or three pounds. They were like quite inexpensive. I thought these would be good if I wanted to go to a lecture and take like some pasta or something. And then the clip and lock ones as well, which I find really handy because obviously sometimes... Um, normal ones like containers just open randomly so with these ones i feel like they'll be more protected and i absolutely love them with like pasta or fruit salads not that i ever eat fruit salads but like i like to take strawberries and bananas and apples and things so i feel like these will be perfect next up i got a decorative piece for my room so i got this vase that's just like says ice cold drink on it it's just like a standard vase and these like roses to go in them and they're fake obviously because i would not be able to keep real plants alive <laughs> they are from home bargains both things so this was like 69p and these were like a pound so like one pound six seventy for all of this is not bad at all and for a bit of decoration in my room i think it looked quite cute on like the windowsill or on my desk or something so i think that is super cute next up i got this k led light because just love like light up things as you can tell oh i still haven't got my curtain lights by the way because i'm still looking for them and getting them and i need i might get them when i'm there to see how like how long i need them so that might be in my like moving in vlog which if you want to see that let me know down below i'm gonna film it anyway <laughs> i'm so flipping excited yeah this is just a light up k and it was 10 pounds from matalan i know it's a bit expensive for a letter k but you know it'll look cute in my room and yeah i just love it and it's so cute and then I got, this is the throw that I got to go with my um, bed in. So I got this Jules throw and it's like all different colours. I don't know if you can see, but it is so beautiful. I absolutely love it. It is so stunning. And it was a bit expensive, as I said in my previous video, but I absolutely love it. And it will look so nice with my new bed in. I'm just so excited to put it all on my bed and like see what it all looks like. And it's just going to look so, so cute. Yes, it's got like pink and blue and grey and red and yellow. And oh my gosh, it just looks so amazing. And I'm so excited to put it on my bed. Next up, I got this bath mat. So it's like a woven bath mat. And it's so cute. It's got little tassels on the bottom. This gave me like Jess Conti vibes. So, <laughs> and I'm obsessed with Jess Conti. She's literally the most beautiful human being 
in the world she's absolutely stunning and i'm just so obsessed with her channel and her and gabriel are just amazing but anyway i got this tasseled thing and it was so so cute and i thought it'd go with the aesthetic of my bedroom and this was six pounds and i got this back in february i have to say but yeah i just absolutely love it and it's amazing i said it was six pounds and i yeah so it's from primark as well and it's so cute and i love it and i can't wait to put it in my room then i got some boring stuff so i got some tissues for my room some ultra soft tissues and they were like a pink theme so obviously i had to have them um in my room they were like 50p a pound not very cheap i mean not very expensive at all and then i just got some soap which smells absolutely amazing can i just say it is pink fizz and elderflower and it smells like a pink, pink prosecco or pink box fizz it smells absolutely amazing i love it so yeah a bit bougie for me but you know thought first to hear what you need you know and then I just got, you know, some sanitary pads and sanitary items because, you know, I need to stock up. And I got four, I got three lots of pads because I just need to stock up on them basically to go to uni because I don't want to be running out like halfway through the year or something. Obviously, I'll need to stock up halfway through the year because three packs won't last me. But yeah, I just thought I'd stock up before I go so I'm not worrying about it. The last thing that I got was this doorstop. And I was watching Eve Bennett's video where she reacted to her first year back at uni. She said that she spent like a lot of money on a doorstop and you didn't really need a doorstop. But um, a lot of my... Um, uni friends have got them for their room so i got this rabbit i thought it was a dog but apparently it's a rabbit um for my room and it was 10 pounds a bit excessive for a doorstop but i thought it was super cute and i absolutely love it and it will look so cute in my room and i just love it so yeah <laughs> that i got sorry to end on like a little like boring thing but it's just but it, to me it's not boring because i absolutely love these and um, basically it's a microwavable dish thing and you can like hold it like this you can put soup pot noodle um whatever you want to put in it and it's obviously got the clip thing which i love and um, so yeah i absolutely love this and it keeps everything in we have one of these that work and like some people put their soup and everything in it and they're just so handy and obviously because they're microwavable as well they're amazing and this was from poundland so it was only a pound so yeah i absolutely love this and i will definitely be using it <laughs> that was everything for the second part of my uni haul i hope you did enjoy this video and also as i said i will pop my list of things i still need to get here if you were using these videos as like a packing list because i know i used a lot of videos as part of my packing list so i'll pop it here on screen and keep it here for a bit so hopefully it's wavering around somewhere here but yeah and also i want to say thank you so 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 much for all my love on my first uni video i did not expect it to like be have such amazing response like i honestly can't thank you guys enough and all your lovely comments and likes and everything it's just so appreciated and i just didn't think it would like get that response so i'm so so happy and yeah thank you guys for making me so so happy about my latest video and just so happy in general because i've always wanted to make a youtube channel and obviously i had it before but I feel like now I've finished sixth form and things it's it was a great venture to start again and obviously going to uni and things so yeah I'm going to do like moving in vlogs and like my room tour and things like that and obviously when I meet my flatmates and stuff I'll hopefully start to vlog more with them with my like uni mates from my course because actually one of the girls on my course is also a youtuber as well which is super exciting um but yeah um i hope you guys did enjoy this video i'm sending all my love in the world and i hope you had a lovely bank holiday um and i hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in my next video which will hopefully be my six form experience survival six form survival guide thing so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video hi guys so my camera just died but um yeah i just wanted to end this video here and just say thank you so so much for all the love i get yeah, um, and I hope you enjoyed this video and I will hopefully see you in my next video for the six form survival guide um, I love you guys so so much and I will see you in my next video bye